Hi, I'm Eli Baker with AgCo, and today I'm going to show you how to export your task data out of your FieldStar 5 or Datatronic 5 equipped Nancy Ferguson S-Series tractor. Up in the cab, we're ready to book and export our data. From the map screen, you want to press and hold the task button. Here, above the file folder, you'll see the book task button. You want to hit that and select OK. You get a pop-up box that the export is finished. You'll select OK. You now go to your file folder. On the right-hand column, you'll see the setting button. You want to click on that. Here, you can see the data exchange page. You want to export your task and select OK. Select OK again. Now you can export the data to your USB drive. You want to hit the export to USB button on the right hand column. On the left hand side of the screen, you can select your data and hit the over arrow to move it over to the USB drive. You'll get a pop up saying the copy has been completed. You can select OK. Now that you have our task data on the USB drive, Using AgCo's AgriLink, we're able to convert this task data into another farm management information system. We have our data on our USB and plugged into our computer. We can log into AgriLink, where we're going to set up an automatic workflow. We're going to click on Director. You can see here it says Automate Across Systems. This will open up a new tab where we'll have Step 1, where your data is coming from, and Step 2, where your data will go. As you can see, there's multiple options for each. For this example, we're going to take our data from the USB and put it into my John Deere. So we're going to click on Bucket, we're going to find our data, Smith Farms, and we're going to select that. On the other side, we'll click on Equipment, select my John Deere, and then we'll select your Smith Farms. Once we do that, we'll need to validate our workflow. It asks if we want to convert our file, which we do as we're putting it over into my John Deere. We verify output format is correct, and we can save this workflow and give it a name. Before we go on, this is a good time to point out. If you have TaskDoc Pro, you can set that up here to automatically send your data from the tractor through AgriLink and into My John Deere, or wherever it is that you're wanting it to go. No need for the USB. We're going to go back to our original AgriLink tab, and this time we're going to click on Coordinator, where you can catalog, organize, and share data. We're going to put this in split view, and we're going to pull up My John Deere, where you can see we have our exported data. This coordinator tab is also where you can import a file manually if you don't have a reason to set up a workflow. Select what folder you want it to go into, select import, choose your file, and it's right there. You could then convert it if needed, and it would be as simple as grabbing it and dragging it to the other side. We won't do that here though, as we already have it from our automatic workflow. Now that we've been through AgriLink and set up our workflow, we can head over to My John Deere. We can find our exported task data. And we can pull it up on the map. And that is how you book and export tasks on your Massey Ferguson Guide Equipped S-Series tractor. Thanks for watching.